while uh, we're cleaning up the excavator, we found some places that needed uh, repairs. And it's also a chance to test the battery powered uh, welder and uh, a wire feeder. This is a Miller wire feeder that uh, was discarded because the computer failed. Why it needs a computer, I don't know. Uh, the, the wire feeding mechanism is perfect. This is an $8 uh, sp speed control for a DC motor uh, up to about 30 amps and uh, it's $8 US free shipping from China and then just the potentiometer sets the speed so once it's set up uh, it works perfectly normally with the with the torch uh, trigger and uh, that's a welder battery powered welder it can be adjusted by turning the switch there are resistances inside just big resistors um, basically nichrome wire coils and by putting the load in series with the welding um, it, you can turn the power uh, down low enough to do MIG weld, a TIG welding and high enough to even burn 70, 18, 1 8 inch uh, rod. And I made a cheater cord that hooks uh, three batteries in series, those high amperage plugs, uh, so it makes it easy just to clip them on. And uh, it's a perfectly viable uh, welder for off grid repairs.